everyone loves to hear about their best qualities and let the bad stuff get swept under the rug. However, one of the gifts of cognitive theory and the MBTIA is the insight it offers about our deficiencies and shortcomings. Being mindful and aware of our weaknesses makes it easier to hone in and develop them. Here is a list of the worst traits of each of the Myers-Briggs types. INTP Represses and ignores feelings. Temperamental outbursts due to buried emotions. Aloof and intellectually conceited. Emotionally unavailable. Unexpressive of feelings. Tendency to be suspicious and distrusting of others. ISTJ can be no at all. enough praise and affirmation to loved ones. ESTJ can be extremely judgmental, stubborn, inflexible, unreasonable, and overly rigid. Can be materialistic. Tend to believe they're always right. Tend to be bossy. May be easily agitated. Impatient with sloppiness and inefficiency. ISFJ tends to leave feelings unexpressed, causing frustration struggles with insecurity and are often too hard on themselves. May avoid trying new things. Avoids criticism. Has a hard time leaving unhealthy relationships. ESFJ. May struggle with insecurity and a strong desire to be liked. Tend to need lots of affirmation from others to feel good about themselves. Can be manipulative, passive-aggressive and controlling. Tendency to gossip tries to guilt trip others. ISTP can be secretive, distant and closed off. Prone to outbursts of anger when overstressed. Don't always know how to express feelings. It doesn't come naturally to them. May avoid and ignore many problems. Tend to have difficulty with long-term commitments. ESTP can be insensitive may not realize or even care about the effect their words have on others. Not naturally in tune with the feelings of others. Can be bossy. Can be somewhat unscrupulous when it comes to getting what they want. ESFP can be very immature. May become overly indulgent and overlook long-term consequences of actions. Can be reckless and imprudent with money. Tend to be overdramatic can be neglectful of their health and well-being in pursuit of pleasure. ISFP tend to hold back feelings and thoughts. May not be good with long-term planning. Avoids criticism. May come off as lazy and slow moving to others. May be uncomfortable verbally expressing their affection. Can be hard to get to know well. ENTJ may have a hard time listening to others, can be a control freak, always wanting to be in charge, may have explosive tempers when under stress, tend to be impatient, have difficulty putting themselves in another's shoes. INTJ tend to believe they are always right, have trouble taking blame, quest for improvement can strain personal relationships, may often be misunderstood and tend to blame others for it. Can seem arrogant and elitist. ENTP can be insensitive and unintentionally hurt others' feelings. May often not finish what they start. Can fall into trap of egotism and self-absorption. Can be unreliable. Tends to overlook or ignore details. ENFJ can be controlling and manipulative, often critical of opinions that don't match their own, tend to sweep things under the rug, tend to blame themselves when things go wrong, tend to strongly fear and avoid being alone. INFJ may be prone to depression, tend to internalize conflict and negative emotion, may have a hard time leaving an unhealthy
peace with themselves. ENFP can be overly anxious and worrisome, may be impulsive and scattered, holds on to bad relationships for far too long, can be unrealistic and naive, unreliable in dealing with mundane daily tasks. INFP can appear illogical, especially in conflict situations. In group situations, may have a control problem, where they want to take over everything, because group member standards often aren't as high as theirs.